एवरीवन हाउ आर यू ऑल आई होप यू आर डूइंग एक्सट्रीमली गुड सो टुडे लेट्स सॉल्व दिस प्रॉब्लम फ्रॉम द लीड कोड कॉन्टेस्ट डिटरमाइन इफ ए सेल इज रीचेबल एट ए गिवन टाइम सो लेट्स अंडरस्टैंड द प्रॉब्लम स्टेटमेंट फर्स्ट सो यू आर गिवन फोर इंटीजर्स दे आर गिवन अवर फोर इंटीजर्स ए सिक्स ए सिक्स इज स्टार्ट ऑफ एक्स एंड एस वाई स्टार्ट ऑफ वाई कॉर्डिनेट and एफ एक्स मीन्स इट इज फिनिश पॉइंट ऑफ एक्स एंड एफ वाई इज अ फिनिश पॉइंट ऑफ वाई सो दीज आर अवर कॉर्डिनेट्स एंड इन इट इज एन इन्फिनेट टू डिग्री इट इज यू स्टार्ट एट द सेल एस एक्स एंड एस वाई एंड ईच सेकेंड यू मस्ट मूव टू एनी ऑफ इट्स एडजस्ट सेल्स इफ यू आर स्टार्टिंग इफ दिस इज माई ग्रेड इफ यू आर स्टार्टिंग दिस यू कैन मूव टू एडजस्ट एनी एडजस्ट पॉइंट Return true if you can reach f of x after exactly t seconds. If you are reaching f of a uh, finish point from the start positions in exactly t seconds, then we can say yeah, I can reach it and I will return true. A cell adjacent cell are the eight cells around it. Suppose if you say this, if you are at this, these are total how many cells? We have eight cells, so it is divided by edge. Total eight cells you can visit. Total eight cells. You can that is that is our uh, uh, that is our condition. You can visit the same cell several times. So suppose uh, if you are at this position, if suppose you are at this point, you can visit here and you can come here. You can visit here and you can come here. You can visit and you can come. In this way, you can visit a single cell n number of times. N number of times. Any number of times. Not even n. Any number of times. I think you have understood this question, so let's solve this. Suppose uh, you are at two comma four and seven comma six. So you can say this: this is two comma four, and is taking this as seven, seven comma seven. At six, t is equal to six. We need to reach finish. One, two, three, four, five, six. We have reached it, and we are returning true. So if you see, start is three comma one, and it is seven comma three, and t is equal to three. One, two, three, four. Minimum it will take four number of operations, so it is taken time as three. So we will return false. Ah, uh, we are not able to reach in three seconds. So if you see, if you observe it carefully, if you observe it carefully, suppose we are at position here, and if you want to reach here, if you want to reach this position, how we can? What is the best thing we can do? Ah, uh, either we can go. This is the our best scenario. Or I can go like this, and this is a best scenario. Obviously, this one, right? Obviously, this this would be my best scenario. So, so if you see, ah, uh, if you given any example, if you has given, if you want to reach from point here to point here, what I will do? This will be my y coordinate, and this gonna be my x coordinate. First, I will decrease, decrease my y coordinate. I will decrease my y coordinate. If uh, from here I can reach here, right? So what I will do? Start of y minus finish of y absolute. I will take because it can be over up or it can be uh, even down. Uh, suppose the infinite grid. If uh, if we are saying like this or in this way, uh, the our position can be towards up. So I will come here and I will come here. And I will reach here, right? I will reach here. How much it gonna take now? I will say this as some distance is equals to uh, y, and suppose a b s of uh, s of x start of x minus start of y, so finish of y. Sorry, finish of x. Sorry, this this will be my x. First, I will reach here. First, I will reach here. Then I will calculate this. How I will calculate this? First, I will calculate this distance. S x minus f of x. I will get this, and and I will subtract. And I will subtract. Uh, total how many I have reached here? Now it's y. Now I am remaining with this. Only I am remaining with this. How you can determine it? A b s of uh, x minus y. X minus y, right? Because 
if you are coming from here to here then my x coordinate will reach this position right hmm? my x coordinate will be this position and only the difference matter is only these two cells only difference matter is two two cells that's why we are separating now we go, we are going to add y plus abs of x minus y to my answer this is going to be my minimum number of operations i can reach to that point uh, to reach that point and and if you see and if you see carefully and suppose i am at this position and i want to reach here i want to reach here so i use if you go like this you will reach here right you will reach here but is there in possibility to reach this position this position yes absolutely we can go like this and we can come like this so by this what we are understand if you are at this position if you are at this position and if you are coming down if you are coming down you can come like this or even like this or like this any way you can come down any in any direction you can come down. suppose if you think this position you can come like this or you can come like this or like this or you can go like this or till till this range till how much it gonna take till this range this will be till this range i can go as abs of sy minus f of y because any position i can reach in this in this distance suppose if if my x coordinate is toward this side or this side any of these positions any of this point then i am going to add then i am going to add. so i will check so definitely i will check right uh, if you are going like this and if my x coordinate is here then i don't need to check uh, to reach this coordinate i don't need to supply uh, add this distance because it's already covered in this range uh, in this range i think you understood it suppose you have one cell and if you want to reach the same cell again how many minimum operations should be there if you minimum operation it should be two right uh, it should be two suppose you can go like this and you can come back two operations if you want to go in three operations we have adjacent cell and we have adjacent cell. we will go here one operation two operation and three operation either it should be two or more if you are at single position you need to check if it is two or more two or more or zero even if you are at this position and finish is at the same position in zero operations it gonna match either zero two three anything except one every possible uh, solution can be my answer so if you see this this is also like right uh, if you are reaching in minimum number of steps if you are calculate minimum number of steps and we need to check if it is less than or equals to time taken then definitely that gonna be answer because now if you see if you are reaching this position like this this point of one two three four five in five operations in five it is saying that uh, in six operations it can be reached absolutely right if you are at this position you can go like this this position and you can come here now we are uh, we are uh, taking a six six position i think you have understood this solution uh, this approach i have co uh, covered all the scenarios so let's walk through the code you are going 10 power 9 10 power 9 so definitely we should do in order of one so first first i will check if this co both coordinates are same this scenario if this both both coordinates are same i will check if t is equals to one t is equals to, i will directly return zero because i can definitely not come to that point then a is equals to abs of sy minus fy this put this uh, suppose i am at this position then i will subtract it right then i will subtract it uh, my y coordinate because this coordinate can be subtracted to reach this position i have subtracted it then i have subtracted uh, similarly even the x positions i have subtracted this even the x positions i have subtracted this as well huh? so we will get this distance now now if if my x is in this region if my x is in this region anywhere in between if anywhere in this in this triangle my x can be in the in this triangle then x is equals to b minus a i am doing x is equals to b is x coordinate b is x coordinate and a is y coordinate b minus a we are doing we are suppose our x is this position then this will be positive then we can add if my x is toward this position we are in the range right we are in our range so no worries right no worries now uh, directly if it is less than zero 
if x is less than 0 i am in my boundary so if a is less than or equals to t then it's true right then it's true and suppose uh, it is out of boundary suppose it is out of boundary suppose it is out of boundary of i am at here and my x is here it is out right then i should come like this sorry i am extremely sorry for la uh, you can come like this and you need to add this extra coordinate if your point is this position you need not add so that's why i have added it and if it is less than t i am returning true and this the time complexity would be order of 1 because we are only performing uh, subtraction operations i hope you understood this solution if you understood please do like and subscribe to my channel and thank you for watching